Hey everyone, Nike here. I needed a backpack to be able to carry around my tech and the bag which is bundled with my laptop is of very good quality. But once you put your laptop within, there's very little space for anything else. I needed a backpack which would allow me to carry all my necessary tech and also be able to carry some clothes for an overnight stay. And I found this, the Mokobara Overnighter, which looks to fit my needs. So let's check it out if it really does. So watch on to find out. This is the Mokobara Overnighter backpack. Comes in this box. Let's get it out. It comes wrapped in plastic and within we have a fiber cover which protects the bag. We have the Mokobara branding on this cover too. And here we are. The bag looks really nice. The material feels premium. We have a small pocket up here and another bigger one below. I purchased the black version, also called Crypto. It's also available in blue and an olive green orange combination. We have the Mokobaro logo in front here. Opening up the pocket on top, it has a piece of foam within. This would help retain the shape. And you can see it has enough space within for items you would need quick access to. We have another pocket within for more security. Now this section has a trick up its sleeve. Just undo the zipper all around and this whole section just pops off and can be used as a sling bag. That's so cool. This is where you would attach the included strap. Even though we have removed this section, we still have another pocket available on the bag. This pocket below is quite big and oh. We have a foam within again. There we go, it's out. We have a decent amount of space within. Now for the front compartment. Take a look at this zipper. It has a protective lip on them, helping with water resistance. Opening up the zips around the bag and it opens up wide, giving you easy access to the inside. This section is where you would pack your clothes or even bigger tech. Bubble wrap, let's get that out. And this is how it looks within. Here we have the USB connectors, one USB-C and the other USB-A. This is a pass through to the USB ports outside the bag. We have the same ports on the outside. One USB-C and one USB-A port which is protected by a plastic flap. Let's connect a power bank to the ports and test them out. Power bank connected and now for the ports outside. I'm using the USB-C port as my power bank supports 65 watt output via USB-C and it doesn't seem to be able to fast charge my phone. And the USB cable is not holding on to the port properly because of this cover here. It says it's going to take an hour via the pass-through ports and when connecting the power bank directly, we can see fast charging is available and is going to take only 18 minutes. Here's the strap for the sling bag. Just hook it onto the front pouch and we can carry it around as a sling. We have a zipper pocket on the top here. Mokobara logo within. Two pockets with good depth. Pockets for pens. This is a spill-proof zipper pocket to carry your toiletries. It will not allow water to seep out. Okay, let's close this section and now for the rear laptop compartment, also called the tech compartment as you can place other items within too. It opens out flat like so. Very easy to access the items within. We have this flannel section for the laptop and it has these elastic straps to keep the laptop in place. Lots of space within. Next is a tablet sleeve for your iPad or Android tablets. Two more mesh pockets can hold your accessories like mice, external hard drives, etc. No small zippered pockets would have been nice if there were some for pen drives, memory card readers and dongles, etc. The back straps are decent, not very padded. I will know more about how comfortable they are once I keep using the bag. We have this magnetic hidden pocket here. We can slip in a phone or wallet for safekeeping. Here's a standard size phone and it slips in quite easily. It's 
easy to remove too. The straps have this latch system to allow tightening and loosening them. We have the Mokobara M here too. A luggage sleeve is present here which allows us to slide it onto our luggage handle making it easy to roll along. We have a bottle holder here with velcro which when opened up can hold a 1 litre bottle. Let's try this Tupperware bottle. It fits. Another trick this bag has is this side zipper that goes all around. Open it up and the bag can expand from 19 litre capacity to 21 litres. It can expand by about 6 centimetres. That's a nice feature. Ok, now let's see how well it accommodates my 15.6 inch gaming laptop. Slide it in and the elastic straps keep it in place. It fits with no problems at all and my other bag zipper just about makes it past my laptop. This one has a lot of space around. It slides in and out quite easily. And as it opens up completely, everything within is easily accessible. Gaming laptops have massive chargers, so let's see how well this fits. No problem at all. And this is how the backpack looks when we are wearing it. The bag is water resistant but not waterproof, so don't immerse it in water or head out in heavy rain. There are tons of options available and finding a good all-rounder backpack is a daunting task. The Mokobara Overnighter does meet my needs and allows expandability when necessary. There are a few niggles but it's still a good option. And uh, Mokobara have tons of options so make sure to go through their website and check them out. So what are your views on the Mokobara Overnighter backpack? Are there better options available at this price point? Make sure you comment below. Also make sure to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when new videos are added. Thank you for watching and see you all next time.